It turned out to be terrific. I'm Dennis Daly with another Secret of the States. In the 1920s, a South Dakota historian suggested a way to get more tourists to visit that out-of-the-way area. Sculptor Gutzum Borglum was asked to use a rock face as a granite canvas to carve the images of famous people. But he rejected both the original site and the concept, settling on a rock outcropping on Mount Rushmore. Borglum also insisted that a work that huge should contain only the likenesses of truly famous Americans, settling on Washington, Jefferson, Lincoln, and Teddy Roosevelt. Today, the Mount Rushmore Memorial is a national shrine. Visited and mapped by Lewis and Clark, famous for the gold rush city of Deadwood, South Dakota was hard hit by the Dust Bowl, but re-emerged as one of the nation's grain bread baskets. I'm Dennis Daly with another Secret of the States.